Welcome to episode 1462, Melanie Perkins, design software billionaire from Australia, 10 lessons. This is an outline of episode 1462, lesson 1 to 5. This is lesson 6 to 10. Lesson 1, the pain and frustration of design. I was teaching design programs and thought they were really complicated and that in the future they should all be online and collaborative and a lot simpler. Um, but this was when I was 19 and I had no... Painful. People use Illustrator, Photoshop, single player mode. Those tools cost a lot of money. What does it take somebody to learn Photoshop or Illustrator today? Yeah. 30, that... 40, 50 hours? Um, way more than that. Like really? you just learn where the buttons are. And two, the grand vision. One place, a few clicks. Insanely complex and completely doesn't utilize the technology that we have available. So we'd integrate the entire design ecosystem and make it really, really simple. Go into one platform and have the entire system at their fingertips. Everyone, even if you've had absolutely no design experience, could design that beautiful presentation or pitch. This was our vision, our grand, grand vision for changing the world of design. And three, dropping out of college to pursue her dream. A university dropout is one of our most successful businesswomen. Lesson four, make complex things simple. She was frustrated by how hard existing software programs were to use, so Canva's goal was to be quick and easy. Today, using Canva, people can create a card, invitation, presentation or resume literally with the click of a button. Lesson 5 said crazy big goals. Only achieved 1% of what she wants and there's plenty more crazy, huge ideas to come. We Lesson 6, start small. Growth for Fusion was investing our profits year on year back into the company. At the time, I was, had just finished uni and started a teaching degree. So teaching was the perfect job while starting a startup because it allowed me to work for six or seven hours a day doing relief teaching at school, jet back home and then um, start another full work day. And that worked really well for about six to eight months until the, the company started taking off. And I could... Lesson seven, it's possible, it's hard. And I realised there's two things. Firstly, to share that it's possible and secondly, to share that it's hard for creating a world-changing company. And so what we did was my boyfriend became my business partner. He's in the audience today. And eight, revise a selling pitch a hundred times. Going to Silicon Valley, getting investment, it's going to be a cinch. That was unfortunately totally not the case. So we were just faced with a wall of problems and rejections and questions. You're the same as some random company we've never heard of. It scares me. Constant, constant rejection. Um, I revised my pitch deck over a hundred times. So nine, recruit a techie co-founder. If we could find a technical co-founder, he'd be happy to invest. And so a whole year of trying to find a technical co-founder later so I was going to conferences, I was going to cold calling people, emailing people, doing... This is the techie co-founder, Cameron Adams. Lesson 10, speed and ease. Paid all that money and had to spend hundreds of hours of learning it. And they upgrade the software, what, every 30 months or something? You got to delete it off your thing and reinstall it. It was just so arduous. What I love with Canva is like you can get on it and have your invite or your business cards, whatever you need to get done within 15 minutes. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and leave your questions and comments below. Wishing everyone peace and prosperity.